आजादी का अमृत महोत्सव आजादी का सफर विद ए आई आर न्यूज नाइन्थ अक्टूबर इज द डेथ एनिवर्सरी ऑफ अ लेजेंडरी फ्रीडम फाइटर डॉक्टर सैफुद्दीन किचलू हेल्ड एज द हीरो ऑफ द जलिया वाला बाग प्रोटेस्ट अगेंस्ट द ड्रकोनियन रावलेट एक्ट ऑफ नाइनटीन नाइनटीन डॉक्टर किचलू वॉज ऑल्सो अ फाउंडिंग लीडर ऑफ द नौजवान भारत सभा विच रैलीड थाउजेंड्स ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स एंड यंग इंडियंस टू द नेशनलिस्ट कॉज He was born on 15th January in 1888 in a Kashmiri family which had moved to Amritsar. A student of sharp intellect, Kichlu completed his bachelor's from Cambridge University in London and obtained his PhD from Germany. His revolutionary aspirations dated back to his Cambridge days when he actively participated in majlis a society formed by indian students to discuss india's colonial woes it was through these meetings that he met india's future prime minister jawahar lal nehru kichlu returned to india in 1913 and started practicing law in amritsar professor amandeep bal head of the department of history in guru nanak dev university amritsar says after his return from abroad one thing that stood out vividly was dr kichlu's devotion and love for the nation dr saifuddin kichlu jab aaye to unhone aake dekha ki agar hame hindustan ko aage leke jana hai to hame milke काम करना चाहिए यही वजह थी कि अगले दिनों में उन्होंने काफी सारी ऐसी एक्टिविटीज में पार्टिसिपेट किया कि यहाँ पे ये चीजें प्रमोट हो जाए डीपली इन्फ्लुएंस बाय महात्मा गांधी एंड द नेशनल मूवमेंट डॉक्टर किचलू लेफ्ट हिज लीगल प्रैक्टिस टू जॉइन द कॉज इन मार्च नाइनटीन द इम्पीरियल लेजिस्लेटिव काउंसिल पास द रावलेट एक्ट विच एम्पावर्ड द गवर्नमेंट टू पुट पीपल इन जेल विदाउट ट्रायल Dr Saifuddin Kichlu was one of the leaders who protested against the legislation. Professor Amandeep Bal says Dr Kichlu's oratory was very powerful. Un dino mein badi badi meetings hoti thi jin mein log inko sunne ke liye jaate the kyunki Dr Saifuddin Kichlu bahut badhiya orator the. Wo Hindustan ki baat bhi karte the, communal unity ki bhi baat karte the, saath mein satyagraha ki baat karte the to log unke sath judte the. On 9th April 1919 Dr Kichlu and another freedom fighter Dr Satyapal helmed an anti-government procession that progressed through the heart of Amritsar. The two leaders were arrested and interned in Dharamshala. On 13th April 1919 a meeting was called in the Jallianwala Bagh to protest the arrest. As the meeting was underway British Brigadier General Reginald Dyer ordered his troops to open fire on the peaceful protesters the troops fired 1650 rounds of bullets at the gathering killing around 1000 as per the indian national congress the government released dr kichlu in december 1919 he was a staunch advocate of communal harmony strongly opposing the idea of partition along religious lines Dr Kichlu suffered a cardiac arrest and passed away on 9th October 1963. On his death, Jawaharlal Nehru remarked that he lost a very dear friend who was a brave and steadfast captain in the struggle for India's freedom.